Hello everyone and welcome back. In this video, I'll show you how to fix error code 128 on stable diffusion. Firstly, let's discuss some common causes of this error. Ownership issue. Stable diffusion needs to detect proper ownership of certain files. Incomplete clone. If the files weren't fully cloned, the software might fall to launch and throw error code 1 to 8. Administrator rights. If you didn't run the installer as an administrator, it could cause issues. And finally, system requirements. Make sure your system meets the requirements, especially having an NVIDIA graphics card with at least 4 GB of VRAM, as Stable Diffusion doesn't support AMD graphic cards. So, to fix the error, follow these steps. Open your Git client application and add your email address. This simple step can resolve the issue. If you suspect an issue with the downloaded files, use this command, which is git config global edit. This command scans and downloads missing files from your repository. Now, go to your stable diffusion web UI folder. Scroll down to the repositories folder, then open git. Type cmd and press enter to open cmd within that folder. Now, all you have to do is pass the command into cmd and run it. This will scan and download any missing files. If the repository can be found, open cmd in administrator mode and return the command with the correct folder path. Now, replace the path in the command with the location of your stable diffusion folder. If all else fails, Delete the entire repository folder. Press Windows plus R and pass this command, which is AppData, and delete the stable diffusion files from that destination. Now all you have to do is reinstall stable diffusion and after installation, run the webuiuser.bot file as an administrator, and this should resolve the issue. And that's it. I hope this tutorial helped you fix the error code 128 on stable diffusion. If it did, please give this video a thumbs up and consider subscribing for more tech tips. Thank you guys for watching and please don't forget to like and subscribe. Thank you for watching and I will see you on the next one.